one all in one PC and the issue with this system is that it won't turn on because the things are not in this place on the screen actually so if I turn it on all the lights come on normally but not in this place on the screen so I'm going to take it back now and show you how to fix it I've removed all the screws already so I'm just going to take it back I remove all the screws to make it easier for this particular video so I'm just take all the parts out and get to where I'm working on actually the part where I'll be fixing today is uh, the is the VGA the VGA processor on the motherboard that is where I'm going to be working on so I'll carefully remove all the parts that I remove the screw for now take out the cooling fan and the heat sink actually the cooling fan and the heat sink are on top of the the processor I'm going to be working on is an processor this is an AMD system and this kind of problem is common with the most AMD PCs so I remove the fan now and then and the heat sink. because it's actually fragile once the bend the heat sink is it becomes hard for air to be able to go in and cool the processor so I'm going to get my workstation on that is what I'm going to be using this is a workstation and then this is the nozzle of the workstation going to be applying heat on the on the process I told you about but before applying heat hot air to it I'm going to um, apply paste I'm going to be applied paste on it so apply a sodium paste and then apply it go and one of the things you need to check is the processor so this is my paste this is my paste so the first thing you're going to do before applying your heat gun apply paste on it cover everything up and then try to cover it up in some cases it will just cover normally because it is because uh, of overheating overheating is actually one of the major issues for this black screen so if that doesn't solve the problem you have to take it apart again and then Sort of paste on it and then apply your heat on the processor. You apply heat on the processor for some time. So that is the process I'm talking about. So you just carefully just apply heat on it. Just move heat around like this. But never before doing that, make sure you apply your for the heat sink get a brush and then brush out dust that might have been hanging in there and dead and if I use it up again that should be able to solve the problem you put it back on it's going to come on immediately I'm going to do another comprehensive video where I show you actually how to apply heat on the VGA there's another video I'm going to do on that so I'm going to close up the 